energy vibration amazing reading for the um, Sagittarius Sun Moon and Rising I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back this is a wonderful week let's see what is happening because it's the energy of the tower so it's a positive energy for you Sagittarius and it's going to be good so for you Sagittarius and um, let's call in the angels and guides to show us what is going to be transpiring for you guys so um, it is the energy of the tower the week begins from the 29th until the 4th and the zodiac energies is the air so for the Sagittarians let's see what's happening ten of swords worries on Monday a lot of worries stab in the back then you have that in transformation Then you have the Knight of Swords coming to you. And then you have Two of Pentacles. Then you have the Three of Swords. Then you have the Eye Princess. Then you have the kind of a, a someone. Wow. You have the energy of the six of pentacles i'm sorry <laughs> i am sorry i'm sorry okay what's happening here i'm looking at this and some of you were stabbed in the back or going to be stabbing back on monday there is going to be an, a transition that's coming in there are going to be people and, and things coming at you um, you're going to be balanced out your, in, your emotional and balancing out certain situations certain aspects three of swords is in reverse so there is not no loss the eye princess you're going to come up with the energy of the eye princess I really want to know something first who is this and what is this all about justice okay so that's about justice what else working together okay and a new journey oh so this is good all righty I'm sorry I, I, I like looking because I was blown away um at the ten of swords you've been stabbed in the back and then because you've been stabbed in the back um, the, the energy of that comes in and it's going to bring it to an end but what is going to happen is that some of you are going to have a situation with the Knight of Swords, and the energy of the Knight of Swords is an Aquarius, a Gemini, and a Libra. And that situation has to do with the Two of Pentacles. So, whatever that situation is, it's you balancing out your emotion and your materialistic world. The Three of Swords is here because you were stabbed in the back, but you're not taking it that way you're thinking you know I know you would have done it so you know what else is new and then the energy of uh, the eye princess comes in so um, the death and transformation and that and the energy of the eye princess comes in so it, the eye princess is saying listen to your intuition 
um, the conniver of swords is actually helping you because what he's doing he's bringing justice and working together to give you a new start and a new beginning because you have been stabbed in the back so um, you know at least he's coming up and and doing something good um, this time you're finally finally at the end of a journey you're finally 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 going through and at the end of a journey and you're moving forward okay so um, all of the lies and stuff that happened in the stab stab in the back and that sort of a thing um, you you felt heartbroken but you weren't heartbroken and it's finally come to an end and a new start is coming in for you a new start is coming in for you so all the things that were happening and and you know all the every town things that you find that was happening now you're seeing with your intuitions and guide and the debt and transformation because what is happening is that a whole lot of you you um, uh, um, there is an energy that is watching over you the your spiritual light beams and um, your um, your you know if your parents or your um, family member pass over they're watching over you and the light beings are watching over you and that is good and they are making sure that a new start comes in for you and it is the end of the night of swords so um it is the end of the night of swords so if you had a situation that you had to be dealing with someone who is uh, an older person, an Aquarius, a Gemini, an, an Aquarius, uh, yeah, an Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Libra. He is now in the reverse form because justice um, stepped in, and justice is working to give you a new start. Isn't that wonderful? Yes, it is. Glory. This is so wonderful. This is this is absolutely wonderful because what is happening is that finally good news is coming after the lies the backstabbing finally there is good news coming and you're moving away so the number six is playing a lot there is a, it's going to be a week of materialistic because the number six you have the six of Pentacles as your energy vibration and you have glory and you have the six of passage okay let's see what else is happening you have the ten of swords and um, the energy of this ten of swords because you have twice the ten of swords and the debt on transformation of these people who are coming in and um, at the outcomes you have the nine of cups okay so it's a it's a bittersweet week if you look at this reading it's a week of bittersweet because it's ruin and it's glory ruin and then happiness the nine of cups so it's a, a bitter really a bittersweet week that is going on here so not to worry because love is going to be and there are going to be family connection yes you're leaving this situation whatever that has happened in the past whatever has transpired in the past you're leaving that and you're moving forward and this is going to be very very good for you this is going to be excellent for you the um, Prince of Swords comes and I am not sure what is happening the Prince of Swords come in and it's your intuition and guides saying to you you know beware of this person just beware of this person whoever he is beware of this person because the Prince of Swords, the Prince of Swords is someone between the ages of 25 and 45 and um, this person yeah between the age of 25 and 45 and is an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra now the situation that is transpiring is um, a karmatic situation your these are all karmatic situations that are happening in your life this really really karma is it's, it's just um, a really situation that is transpiring it's just karmatic situation is is things that you've sorry come in this lifetime 
to really um, cleanse and uh, um, you are going to be capable and be able of cleansing this and move forward with your life and this is going to be good it's going to be good so not to worry what is happening it's going to be good okay for you guys it's all about new beginnings in this week it's really about old new beginnings in this week okay and this is going to be very positive it's all about new beginnings in this week it's going to be a real positive week you know after a lot of karmatic situation that you had to be dealing with um, and working out with people it's finally going to come to an end all the lies and backstabbing because there was a lot there is a lot of lies and backstabbing it was from one lies and backstabbing and you moving away and you having glory and then another lies and backstabbing and then at finally relationships people um, who are in um, you know long relationships this is going to be a positive week where um, there's an healing that is coming in there is just a positive healing that is coming in and um, it's, it's, it's wonderful because um, what is transpiring is that there is certain sort of energy a certain sort of a thing um, justice is working together with you to actually um, res a resolution of uh, um, making a new beginning for you and this is going to be good so let's see what is happening fake card and quest fake card and quest you have fake card and quest okay now fake card um, and then justice balance fake card um, it is you are moving forward you are trying to move forward on a good part in your life you're trying to um, find you know that place where you forgive and have unconditional love and then after you're going on a quest to find true peace and true happiness and this is wonderful so enjoy this rest this peace and happiness and um, you are going to see that um, after all this unnecessary um, situation that has happened you are going to really really come out on top um, no matter what okay So, ladies and gentlemen, please like, share these videos. Have a wonderful week. Namaste.